Cretan archers were a well-known class of warrior whose specialist skills were extensively utilized in both ancient and medieval warfare. They were especially valued in armies, such as those of the Greek city-states, Macedonia and ancient Rome, which could not draw upon substantial numbers of skilled archers from their native populations. Topic history The use of bows and arrows by Cretan hunters is indicated as early as 2200 BC, in a Minoan seal. A mosaic discovered in Gnosis and dated about 1700 BC portrays warriors armed with bows of both simple and double convex designs. Though Cretan archers could be theoretically outranged by Rhodian slingers, they were widely recognized as being amongst the best light missile troops in the ancient world, and as such found employment as mercenaries in many armies, including Alexander the Great's and those of many of the Diadochi. During the retreat of the 10,000 following the Battle of Cunaxa in 401 Xenophon's hoplites were able to hold off pursuing Persian troops, with the aid of the Cretan archers who formed part of the Greek mercenary army. On this occasion the Cretans, cut off from supplies, were able to gather and reuse the spent Persian arrows while seizing bowstrings from local peasantry. Xenophon records that Cretan archers were outranged by their Persian counterparts and suffered losses because they wore no armor. Following the conquest of Macedonia and of the independent Greek city-states, Cretan archers served as auxiliaries in the Roman army as reformed by Gaius Marius under the Republic, and that of the Empire. Mediterranean light archers in Roman service from the 3rd through the 5th centuries AD might wear leather caps or be bareheaded. The chain mail of earlier periods was replaced by leather jerkins or long-sleeved tunics, in favor of increased mobility and economy. Secondary weapons for use at close quarters included light axes and small round shields slung from a belt and suitable for parrying. An auxiliary unit of mounted Cretan archers, Cohors I Cretum Sagittariorum Equitata, fought in the Dacian Wars of 102–105 AD and continued to serve in that province until at least 161 AD Crete remained part of the Byzantine Empire until seized by Venice in the aftermath of the Fourth Crusade. During much of this period the island was a theme military province, providing both archers and sailors for the Byzantine forces. In 1452 Venice granted specific permission for Byzantium to resume recruitment of Cretans. One of the last occasions on which Cretan archers are known to have played a significant role was as part of the garrison defending Constantinople against the Turkish army of Mehmet II in May 1453. Topic in popular culture Cretan archers, along with Rhodian slingers, are included in the video games Rome, Total War, Total War, Rome 2 and Total War, Arena, where they are available to be hired as mercenaries. Topic footnotes Topic References Bigwood, J. M. Tejas's Historian of the Persian Wars, Phoenix 32, No. 119-41. Eccles, Edward C. The Ancient Slinger, The Classical Weekly 43, No. 15-227-230. Further reading MacLeod, W. The Ancient Cretan Bow, Journal of the Society of Archer Antiquaries 11 1968, 30-31.